Hey guys, it's your boy Zale or Drake is here again. And well, it's time for another unboxing video. And the last time was yesterday on Memorial Day was on a motorized Henry and Winston pack. Whereas I mainly wanted just to get that Winston and the top and half. Where is the bomb right over here? So yeah, also too. What are we going to look at today? Well, guess what? It came f it came from eBay and just arrived today. I didn't technically order it on eBay. What I actually asked was, I asked one of my teachers that I can buy from my eBay as a birthday present. Which is my birthday's tomorrow. As another diesel character. Now, the last one that we did was... Back in April with this Boko right here. Which I'm very grateful to have Boko. Which the bad news is that for my good friend Train King, Boko is not working anymore. I mean like he explained to me that he pray it was he was rough with him and that way doesn't work with him. If I can get it to Justin Train King, he I just need like a new battery or new refurbishment. Thanks how you pronounce that. Correct me in the comments below. Anyway, that's not important right now. Well, it came today from my and uh, from my teacher as a present. Here's the eBay. I didn't technically order it. I just asked well one of my teacher can buy me as a birthday present. That's why. And it came from eBay. So yeah, I'm not gonna show you the address or the character. Now, what I'm going to do, let's get to the boxing of this day. Before I show you the engine, I want to show you the wrong stuff that came with it. Let me just take out the tape on it first. Oh, that was easy. Aha! Look at this slate truck. This is Blue Mountain Quarry. Wow, this straight this slate truck is pretty nice. This is Blue Mountain Quarry. Maybe this should be go with some of my Nalgis engines for my Nalgis episodes. I got to admit, this is pretty nice, I just say. Oh, look. Uh, what else that came with it? It said this. Thanks for supporting small businesses. Please don't forget to leave a positive feedback. Stores, eBay.com, quality chains, and more. Oh, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice to sell to give him this thing. Okay, now for the real thing y'all can wait for. So who is this new engine that I just ordered? It is... Paxson! Yes, from Day of the Diesels and Blue Mountain Mystery. There he is. But before that, let me just take let me just take him out. Mm. All right, here he comes. <gasps> wow! Look at this. Look at this Paxson model right here. This is so a beautiful model. I mean, there is also like a Trap Method 2 slash so more I was than him. Well, at least back last year. But I'm extremely grateful I have this as of right now. So, if you don't know who Paxson is, he and the character were introduced in Day of the Diesels. Where he was played Splatter and Dodd, despite... 
Chen Men wanted them in the move, but they would drop. And sp and pa and Pat and Cindy were introduced into his place flat on the place flat on Dodge. I mean, in the movie he did talk but he was not named until like the music video of Day of the Diesels, with he was named Paxson, along with that blue diesel named Sydney, who didn't appear that much because he didn't have his wheels on until the season 17 episode, The Myth and Critical Tree Decorations. And there was another character named Norman, who would dance his brother, who was also going to be in the movie, but he would sadly drop. Anyways, Paxson, I pretty much enjoyed Paxson as a character. Then Blue Mouth and Mystery, he get, got a, a slightly bigger role than before. And he appeared a lot often in GDI series as like a returning character. So yeah. And he did get some pretty cool merchandise, like he got this trap master model, which I'm happy to get finally at last. Wooden railway, take and play, take and play, as well as puzzle law. And he also got a Botman model in 2018 along with Rusty. Which I was not expecting that to happen, but that's pretty cool. And he's my second B all class diesel that I've got. With the first one is being diesel. Since they both are the same class, but they're not related to each other. Since passing slightly a bit slightly a little bit longer than diesel. Since his model was made in 2012. Like when Day the Deezus came out. Patton was not made during that time for Trap Master, but he was made for winning Railway and for Take and Play. His Trap Man model was not released until 2012, when they, when Bloom Out of the Mystery came out. Which is pretty cool because he took get like bigger roles instead of like of being used as character. Let's talk let's let's talk through like the model Paxton first. The phase this is a pretty good Paxson phase. It was some packing from the GDI series, which I do like his personality because he's very friendly, like Salty and Mavis, as well as Boku and Daisy. Now for the side, I love this green right here. I love this green. And he also got like this yellow stripe that he has, which is also a pretty nice touch. Along with this black detail right here. Oh, I can't forget about this orange face side rod. It's all the pretty nice touch, but at the same time, I wish like these characters who have fake side rods should have like real ones instead of fake ones. But beggars cannot be choosers. Now I'm on the top. He does have the two these black these four black things on the top. Now the side is also pretty much the same thing. And on the back, nothing special. And here the back history of Paxton's model. So Paxton was released in 2012 when Blood when Blue Album Mystery came out. And he only sold about like around two years between 2012 and 2013. And also in 2014 too. And he so pretty decently well. He you can either get him with these two blood and these blue mountain Koi slate trucks and his greatest moments pack. As well as him alone with a red slate truck. But then when Trap Matter 2 came along, Pack thing was sadly discontinued. That's a pretty real shame because Paxton didn't know one of my favorite Diesel characters because I like his personality because he's very kind and very friendly. I pretty much enjoy his personality. And should I introduce my Paxton to my series? If you think so, turn in the comments below. Like, some of my Diesel characters I have to show right now are Diesel, Diesel 10, Boko, Salty, and Rusty. Whereas Diesel was the first one, with Diesel 10 being second, then Rusty third, Salty fourth, and Boko fifth. 
with Paxton being the sixth one. And I pretty like his green. It reminds me like a dark green. Now, before I do sign off, I do need like to undo Paxton's battery to see how he runs. Like this is what he looks like on the bottom. I want to see how he runs real quick before I do have to sign it off. Like the preset pretty, pretty much good care of this model. Okay, this is back packs in his battery compartment. Let's see how he works. Oh, he sounds pretty much pretty good. Even though he is sound a little bit noisy. Let me just screw it back in. He does sound a little bit noisy, but Paxton is pretty much okay right here. And also too, this was also one of the first Paxton mods I got. This mini Paxton act like the flying dozen from SpongeBob SquarePants. That the only one or two I got this. Was I want to get a big shout to my teeth to bring to me as a present from eBay. So yeah, and that was the surprise. So I hope you enjoyed this unboxing video of Paxton, the Trap Master 2012 Paxton. And what's your honest opinion on the Trap Master Paxton that guy? Do you like this model or do you dislike it? Tell me in the comments below because I'm curious. And hopefully in the future if I get the budget, I get like more of these real old class like Airy Bird and Splatter and Dodge. And also I can get like another diesel to make Sydney. So hope you you stay tuned for more of these videos. Well, stay tuned for more videos of Isaiah Rodriguez. This is me, Isaiah Rodriguez, signing out. Bye.